everyone welcome to my channel it's ruby talks so in this video we are going to discuss 10 things that i absolutely love about canada so let's just dive into the video at number 10 we have natural resources and parks so in canada we have a lot of natural resources and parks we have niagara falls we have Banff national park we have lake louise uh, we have you know northern lights in yukon territory amazing so i mean canada is blessed with you know these natural resources and great parks and you know scenic destinations to view so that that's the reason that i like canada at number nine we have you know uh, we have a lot of outdoor activities may it be winter or may it be summer uh, you know in winters you can have uh, snowshoeing uh, tubing skating and you can have uh, skiing you know all the that kind of activities in summer we have cycling running you know all those kind of uh, outdoor sports that you want to play so we have like going to a nat nature park or we can hike you know so canada in canada we can do the sports uh, all year round so uh, that's the another thing that i love about canada so guys at number eight we have that canada is very immigrant friendly you will find a lot of immigrants here in canada because canada has a huge amount of land and uh, you know which is still not occupied so last year in 2021 uh, canada brought in more than 400,000 of immigrants from all over the world so i mean it is very immigrant friendly country i mean there are no cases there are no or like very less cases of you know like uh, uh, immigrant uh, racism or you know stuff like so guys at number seven we have education in canada even i did my masters from canada uh, i mean i will make a video about that i mean how much did it cost and everything but uh, you know i mean in canada we have a great quality of education and which is very affordable i mean the standards are up to uh, us uh, but you know the price is much more less than the us so i mean if you are looking for uh, affordable education with the quality as compared to us so i mean canada is a good option for you so i i did my masters at concordia i mean it cost me around thirty thousand dollars so i mean uh, but yeah it was it was worth it so right now at number six we have free health care so i mean in canada uh, free basic health care is provided to all the permanent residents to citizens and to the refugees so i mean government of canada will pay for your basic uh, health care issues so you don't have to pay uh, expenses out, out of your pocket just like in us or india we have that we don't have the insurance per se by the government but uh, we have to pay from our own pocket but in uh, in canada uh, government pays for your basic health care okay coming at number fifth we have this concept of minimum wage in canada so it's like uh, there is a minimum wage set by the government that uh, you know every province have their own minimum wages set so if you're working in ontario you have a different minimum wage if you're working in quebec you have a different minimum wage so it's set by the government of canada so that you know no one can exploit you or no one can give you less than the minimum wage so i mean everybody in canada can make a decent living if they are you know doing a full-time work on uh, on even minimum wage so i mean that's a very good point in india we don't have that system at all i mean you know it's it's the monopoly of the employers they can do whatever they want and uh, you know i mean the workers are getting uh, exploited like that so guys at number four we have you know we have better public services may it be ambulance or or police you just call 911 911 if you uh, you know ha are having any trouble unlike india i mean if you call police i'm i'm not sure like if 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 they're going to come on time but here you know these services are uh, very reliable and you know if you're stuck somewhere you can call police if there's some emergency somewhere you can call police and uh, you know these services are very reliable in canada and you can really trust trust on uh, police in this country number 3 the thing that i absolutely love about canada is it it is literally pollution free country the air is so clean that you know if, if i will show you the screenshots of my uh, weather i mean i will show you so these are the screenshots that define the pollution level in 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 uh, ottawa right now and this is the pollution level in delhi right now so i used to work in noida earlier and you can see that you know they say like uh, you know if you if you're working in delhi or if you're working in noida so you i'm not sure like how many packs of cigarette you smoke 
per day if you you know are working in delhi or noida so the air over there is so hazardous and you know like sometimes they have to cancel the cricket matches sometimes they have to you know uh, issue a warning and the situation is getting worse day by day so the absolutely uh, amazing thing about canada is the air is literally so clean and so pure so at number 2 guys we have that you know in canada if you are a permanent resident or if you are a citizen or if you are a refugee the children's basic education till grade 12th is free yeah it's free so i mean you don't have to pay anything out of your expense government handles all the necessary you know uh, education of your children that's why i mean in canada the literacy rate is very much up because you don't have to pay anything for the for your children's education in canada and the quality of education is again very good i mean uh, very best in 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 all the north america there are the thing that i love about canada is that you can you know in it's so safe if you, if you if you want to go outside it's still so safe if you are work if you're walking on on the street at night it is very safe at the night as well i mean in india you have to like think thousand times before leaving your house and if you're on a public you know transit then you know literally god bless you so i mean uh, these kind of situations are not here in canada i mean canada is free from all the third world problems i mean i'm not saying like india is bad but you know certain situations still exist there and certain mentality still exists there so i mean th- those are the you know reasons that i absolutely love canada So guys that was the video and thank you for watching and keep sharing and keep subscribing.